you led us immediately into a, a snapshot of your organization. And that was really, really good because that's what this whole speech was supposed to be about. You told us what you were going to tell us. You said there were three points. You told us what the three points were. And throughout the whole speech, everybody knew where he was in the speech. That's a really important thing when you're doing a speech because it helps the listener organize in their mind and connect more with what you have to say. So I thought that was that was very important. I, it, my questions to evaluate your speech, one of them was about your transitions. Were they appropriate and helpful? You had very little transitions between your points, but I'm not sure you really needed them because you were so clear and they were so concise that I didn't feel that that was necessary in the way that you organized your speech. So that was very good. But I'm asked the question, what could the speaker have done to make it more effective? The, your pattern of speech is fairly quiet and you had some important things to say. Do you have children? Yeah. When you want to tell them something important, you don't say, if I were you, I wouldn't play with fire. You say, look at me. <laughs> I've got something important to tell you. And you project it. And there were places where you had something that important to say. And I wanted you to lock eyes with someone in your audience and tell. Mm. Deliver it. What else? Like, um, I'm reminded... I'm reminded of Andrew Williamson. When he first started, he had very much a similar demeanor. He was very quiet, mm -hmm. very laid back. And what we found as he developed and grew, that there was a funny, funny person in there that just needed to be unleashed. Mm -hmm. And I would very much like to see you up here one day unleashed. Mm -hmm. I think that you would present to us a very, very trenchant speech. <laughs> Thank you.